Hello, Ken Wisenhunt, Offensive Coordinator for the San Diego Chargers, and it's my turn today to talk about one of our plays from yesterday's game against who was that? Oh yeah, the Tennessee Titans. Anyway, exciting play. I think most of you have seen the highlight uh, of Melvin on the long run. This was in the second quarter. I think, obviously, big play for us in the game, but one of the unique things about this play, which I'll show you here in just a second, is this is, I think, play 26 in the game. So we've been running the football, having success, moving it. It scored twice already. So it put the Tennessee Titans in a little bit of a desperation mode. And on this play, which is unusual in the middle of the field, it's a zero blitz. What does that mean? It means they're actually bringing everybody. If you look at the, both the safeties back here, on the snap of the ball, they're coming. Now it's very hard to run the ball against that kind of look. But what makes this play so, so unique is two players did a great job on this. And I want to show you from the end zone perspective. Obviously a great, great run, big play, got us down uh, in the red zone, and we scored a touchdown from that. But look at this from this perspective. We've got a bunch formation to the left. Antonio Gates is right here, and Dontrell Inman is right there. Now, one of the things that was really critical for us with Hunter Henry having been out is that we really needed Antonio to do some things in the run game that he doesn't usually do. So we set it up so he'd have a little bit of an angle on a blocker instead of having to take the guy on straight. And you'll see right here, He's going to come inside on the snap of the play and actually hits the blitzing linebacker right in the mouth and does a great job on the block. But as I talked to you just a little bit ago about the fact that this was a zero blitz, the guy we can't block is this safety right here. Dontrell, number 15, his responsibility on this play is to actually block the guy that he's on right here and he's doing a good job. But one of the things that's been so impressive about Dontrell and his growth as a receiver for us is he sees the zero blitz. Now he knows that the man over him has got him in man coverage, so he's got to go with him. And what he does, which is really impressive, is he drops him and he goes in and he blocks the inside guy. Now he gets just enough of a chip on him that it opens the hole. And you can see the defender that's on him goes with him. Now we've got Griff Whalen here coming and he goes actually for the, for the next corner that's got him. But as you can see, because of the two guys blocks, which I'll pause it right here, Antonio on the linebacker, and Dontrell chipping off on the zero blitz safety, it opens up a huge hole, which Melvin hits and then races down the sideline. So once again, in a situation where obviously the offensive line did a great job with this play, and it was a big play for us, but two players that we really needed to count on, Antonio Gates doing a great job for us in the run game, amazingly enough, and Dontrell Inman stepping up and being a good blocker for us after the last couple of weeks where he's really excelled as receiver, led to a big play for us, which actually put us up three scores in this game, so it was a, a good play. Handing off this time, Gordon has a little bit of a hole here, 35-30, 25-20 to the near side, pushed out of bounds at the six-yard line from behind. Just as we talk about, oh, it's all Philip Rivers. How about a 44-yard burst around left end for Melvin Gordon?